so nice in about that defensive performance last night. Remind us, it reminded us of last season, right? The way you guys were really stopping guys from getting to the rim and also contesting threes. What do you take away from yesterday's game? Yeah, I thought, you know, we were very good at, at team defense uh, Team defense last night. You know, everyone had each other's backs, you know, we're rotating, you know, being there on shifts on guys like you know, Jaron Jackson Jr. You like to get downhill, you know, you have to be there, stop them early. And uh, I, thought, I thought our overall defense was uh, very good. We communicate and switch and being physical. So uh, that was the main main part that helped us get the win last night. And Dyson, what do you feel about when you guys implement the zone defense for a player too? Do you feel like that really is something that can work and be successful moving forward for you guys? Yeah, for sure. You know, last night was really successful for us. You know, we ran it a couple of times and got some stops. You know, I think it forced a lot of like late shot clock shots on that as well. So, um, you know, we, we didn't have not run zone much at all. So for us to go out there and execute it um, was definitely something we can pull out now. You played uh, a few minutes with a lineup that featured CJ, Jordan, Matt. Um, what was it like working with that kind of space and having that kind of shooting around you? Yeah, it was great. You know, uh, those guys spaced the floor really well. And, you know, obviously CJ can shoot and get downhill. Um, you know, I like to get downhill. So I think you know, just having that space you know, and, you know, making the, the opposing team, you know, have to own their man and, you know, guard their man and be close to opens up driving lanes and uh, opportunities for us to get, get to the rim. So I think, you know, when we have that lineup in, we're really good. I feel like it, it creates confusion for opponents on the defensive end, where especially when you're pushing in transition, who to match up and what to take away. Exactly. And, you know, people aren't used to guarding that lineup either you know especially with no big out there and um you know just uh, it, like you said it creates confusion and people aren't used to guarding that so just switching it up you know i think the coaches did really good with rotating guys through last night so um you know hopefully you know we can see the lineup out of there again that's can you describe what it's like comparing last season your first game to this season's first game where you are mentally yeah i mean i'm just a lot more comfortable out there you know i know what i'm doing you know i know what i have to do to you know help the team win you know I feel like I can be more aggressive still, but you know I'm still um, you know figuring out how to play play with different lineups and stuff. But you know I feel a lot more comfortable out there. You know getting to my spots, you know defending, switching. Um, you know being out there with a guy like Herb, you know where we can switch, you know with uh, with bigger guys as well. So um, yeah, I just feel a lot more confident, and comfortable out there. And speaking of Herb, how much fun is it when you both of you guys are out there on the court causing havoc? Do you feel like that's something that you know can be a real weapon for you guys moving forward? Yeah, for sure. I think you know it's great being out there with her, another great defender. So just being out to you know put him on the five man, put me on the one man, and you know, when they set screens, switch it. You know they get no advantage from it. So uh, I think that's one of our strengths we have this year. And you know, the other guys on that on that lineup, you know, can defend as well. So we've got a lot of length um, when we go that small ball. So um, you know it's been working for us early. How much confidence does it give y'all as a as a group to? Win the first game on the road and then head into the first home game with a win already, you know, on the books. Yeah, I think it's, it's important to get off to a great start, you know, uh, being one to know, um, you know, that's important, you know, it gets the energy going, gets the team chemistry up. So, um, you know, we want to keep carrying it over and hopefully go on a big run here to start the season.